Last week, the manager said he doesn't see many better left backs in football today than you. How does that make you feel? Yeah, of course. Uh, very happy. I think you know, there's there's been a lot lot of things said about me, but you know, I've just kept my head down, worked hard, and you know, for me, it was all about proving the manager wrong. It wasn't about anyone else or or what people were saying outside. I sort of sometimes tend to ignore it, and you know, just work hard, keep my head down, you know, keep motivating myself because. I want to play at this club, it's the biggest club in the world and you know, I want to be here and I want to be playing and playing every week and you know, to to sort of turn around and get that sort of confidence from the manager was, was really pleasing and you know, it, it pushes me, me on even more now and you know, I just keep working hard, keep sort of quiet, keep my head down and just keep doing what the manager needs me to do. In terms of your competition, <coughs> Ashley Young also having a great season, but is he also someone that you can learn things from? Yeah, of course. I think Ash has unbelievable experience. You know, he's he's played in many different positions, but for me, he's been amazing this season. You know, really good, strong defensively, and you know, as as we all know, he's a, an amazing attacker as well. And you know, he's really helped the team. And yeah, of course, it's nice and it's it's good for competition because it it pushes both of us on. And you know, we both work hard and and we both want to be playing. So. It's only good for the team, I guess, because if you know everyone's pushing themselves more and more and we're getting the best out of ourselves, then, like I said, it's only good for the team and, and for the squad and, and I guess for the manager for, for when he needs to pick the team. Yeah, you mentioned the manager. You've had 18 months or so under him now. Do you think sometimes that sort of tough love approach can work and ultimately make you a better player? Yeah, of course. I think it's def definitely made me stronger mentally. I think I've come out a, a new person, sort of, mentally and, and physically on the pitch and, and you know I think I've improved on that but for me it's all about mental I think when you first hear stuff like that it's hard but you know you just got to take it on board take what he says and you know I guess he's always believed in me but he just maybe wanted me to, to change a few things about myself and you know I guess I'm doing that and, and I'm doing what he wants so as long as I keep on doing that and keep proving him sort of wrong I guess and oh, everything's good. In terms of Friday's game, it will be Mourinho's 100th as United manager. 61 wins, 176 goals and three trophies. So how would you sum up his time at the club so far? <laughs> Amazing. Um, we all knew he's one of the best managers and the most successful manager you know, in, in the world. And you know, it was really sort of pleasing for everyone to, to come here. And yeah, of course, it, for me personally, for, for the training, for the tactical, for, for the way he is, the way he communicates... He, he is one of the best in the world and, you know, it is a pleasure to work under him and, you know, it's enjoyable at the same time as well, sometimes serious, sometimes enjoyable, but, no, it's really good and, you know, long may it continue and, you know, the record speaks for itself and, you know, the goals and, and the games we've won and, you know, the big matches we played and the points we've got out of that, like I said, speaks for itself and, yeah, long may that continue and, you know, it's, Really looking forward to, to the future, I guess.